Imagine living in a city surrounded by arid land, yet lush gardens bloom and fountains sparkle. This wasn't magic, it was the genius of early engineers who mastered the movement of water. Thousands of years ago, people created intricate irrigation systems, digging canals and constructing dikes to bring rivers to their crops. In Mesopotamia, the cradle of agriculture, farmers diverted the unpredictable Tigris and Euphrates, transforming dry plains into fertile fields that could sustain growing populations. Meanwhile, the Romans built monumental aqueducts, some stretching over 50 miles, channeling fresh water to cities, baths, and even private homes. These stone marvels relied on subtle slopes, just enough for gravity to guide water across valleys and hills without pumps or machinery. In Peru, the Nazca carved underground aqueducts called puquios, spiraling deep into the earth to tap hidden springs and maintain a steady water supply year-round. Each innovation responded to a single, shared challenge, how to survive and thrive when water was scarce or distant. These feats weren't just practical, they were visionary, shaping societies and landscapes for centuries, proving that human creativity can move mountains to bring life-giving water where it's needed most.